here with ITSEC TV. We are here at the Sterling Dynamics booth. We are talking to Ron. How are you? I'm very good. How are you? Good, thank you. And Simon? Hi, good to see you. Thank you for having us. Yeah, it's glad to, glad to be here. Lovely. So tell us a little bit about how long you've been coming to ITSEC. Uh, well, ITSEC is a show we've been coming to now for uh, 15 plus years. Wow. Yep, and uh, it's a very important show for us, mm -hmm. uh, mainly because it's all inclusive. We have all of our customers, mostly, uh, large and small here, gives us an opportunity to engage with them. Uh, we have a lot of our vendors are here, a lot of our colleagues are here, and an area that I don't know gets enough attention is the academia portion. Uh, mm -hmm. So we get to talk to and uh, sort of mentor some of the younger uh, up and coming industry engineers that are gonna be working in the future, so that's important to us as well. So That's a great yeah. point, I've never yeah. thought of that. Yeah, yeah. Tell me what else you enjoy about being at ITSEC. Well, another great benefit is that the end users are here as well. So not only are our customers here, but the actual users of the flight controls are here. So we get to engage with them and get their feedback. Uh -huh. And that's always very beneficial. So the Air Force is here, the Marines, the Navy, the uh -huh. Army. It's very important that we get an opportunity to speak with them as well. So what did you bring this year? Well, we brought a couple of things. We brought our CH-53K. Uh, active controls that we just recently delivered to the U.S. Navy. Uh, it's going to be part of the King Stallion training system uh -huh. and we're hoping to uh, do more deliveries of that. Uh -huh. And we brought this uh, VR demo that uh, Simon can talk more about, but okay. uh, we brought that as well. How exciting. Yeah. Tell me a little bit about the VR demo. The set that we brought this week is to show how we can use our active controls to train pilots so we can electronically link students and instructors together so they don't have to be in the same place and we, the students and the instructors can feel each other's movements through the controls. Oh wow, that's super exciting. So tell me a little bit about what you changed with some of the controls then. Well, uh, we brought a variety of control products with us uh, this week. Uh, mm -hmm. We have a range of very high fidelity and medium fidelity products. They're all interchangeable uh, in terms of the grips, yeah. uh, in terms of uh, configuration. Mm -hmm. uh, they can be reconfigured in a number of different ways so they can be applicable to um, a multiple different types of aircraft. Wow, how exciting. Yeah. Nice. And then uh, what would you like to touch on with the VR? Well, we realize that the, there's a big market now for using VR-based training. Um, but the issue a lot of the training schools have is that the very low fidelity controls, so even though you've got a good visual environment, the controls don't feel like the real aircraft. So with our controls, the students actually get to feel what the real aircraft feels like. Oh, absolutely. I wouldn't have thought of that. That's perfect. You guys have thought about everything. We do our best. Yeah. Well, thank you so much for being a part of ITSEC, and uh, we look forward to seeing you guys again next year. Yes, you will. Thank you so much. Thank, thank you. you. Yeah. Stay tuned for more at ITSEC TV.